All right, people, so here is your end of week five report. So before we go ahead and get started with week six, let's go over what happened in week five and uh, what are the current standing. So in week five, match one, we had the Yuma Utopians using Light Swans versus the Yusei Star Dragons using Ritual Beasts. So tier three Light Swans versus tier two Ritual Beasts. Ritual Beasts ended up pulling out the victory, earning the Yusei Star Dragons one point. In match two, we had the Yuya Pendulum Dragons with Evil Swords versus the Kite Galaxy Photon with Madoche. So, uh, tier three off, and I believe the Evil Swords won against Madoche, earning them a one point. In match three, we had the Yugi Dark Magicians using Sylvans uh, versus the Zane Cyber Dragons with Black Wings. Of course, uh, the Yugi Dark Magicians did not show up, uh, but. We decided to go ahead and award the same type of dragons one point, even though it would have been one point if the Black Queens would beat the Sylvans anyway. And in match four, we had the Kaibawai dragons with Infernoids versus the Jack Red Archies with Burning Abyss, tier one versus tier two. And uh, Burning Abyss pulled out the victory, earning them one point. So, at the end, the current standings are in the YCS division at the end of week five. And first, we have the Kaibawai dragons with four points. And the second, the Yuya Pendulum Dragons, also with four points. You're probably wondering why one's first and one second when the points are even. It's because in the division match, the Kaiba White Dragons beat the Yuya Pendulum Dragons, so that's why they're ahead despite the points being even. And third, we have the Kite Galaxy Photons with three points, and bringing up the rear and fourth, we have the Yuma Utopians with zero points. And in the regional division, at the end of week five, we have Yusei Star Dragons leading with seven points. In second place, we have the Jack Red Archons with five points. And third, we have the Zane Cyber Dragons with three points, and bringing up the rear. And fourth, we have the Yugi Doctor Shins at zero points. So, people, we are almost at the end. We are about to start week six and week seven, and then that's it, people. That's it for the regular season. We'll be heading up into the playoffs. So, of course, how it works is that the bottom team will get the drop, the top team will get the buy, and the two middle teams will be duking it out in the playoffs, where we have a best of three matches. Where each time I will go ahead and ask the team which deck do you want to choose, and uh, they will be fighting it off in the first week of the playoffs. So I hope that you guys continue to enjoy and support the league. So thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and yeah, see you guys soon. Enjoy week six.